It's hip hop to celebrate Harmony Day. The Indigenous Hip Hop Project, the first of many talented and culturally diverse musicians and dancers to entertain crowds at the Harmony Day Festival in Sydney. The festival at the Belmore Sports Ground is one of three and a half thousand events happening across Australia to celebrate Harmony Day on March 21. At the centre of celebrations, a citizenship ceremony in which 10 people from as many different nations officially became Australians. It's remarkable that today 45% of Australians were either born overseas or had at least one parent. By any world standard, that, that's enormous. Parliamentary Secretary for Multicultural Affairs and Settlement Services, Laurie Ferguson, says Harmony Day is a chance to recognise that community diversity has brought cultural, social and economic wealth to Australia. We speak over 300 languages, originating from 230 countries. In less than a lifetime, we've changed from an Anglo-Celtic society of fewer than 8 million people to a multicultural society of more than 22 million. The Department of Immigration and Citizenship is working with organisations such as the Australian Football League and Australian Federal Police to ensure all Australians get involved in Harmony Day. It is about uh, a cohesive and inclusive community um, and from our point of view, from, uh, from a law enforcement agency, um, that's extremely important to us. The AFL running a community competition as well as sports clinics for football stars in the making. It is sport that often provides the ground under which people can play and come to a game without any of their background uh, causing anything other than a celebration. Harmony Day events will continue throughout March. Good morning. Let everybody free.